Well, we've just listened to Governor Malloy's uh, budget address here at the state capitol, and I must say it's a big disappointment for a lot of people. I think Connecticut taxpayers are really going to get hit very hard with this budget proposal. But more importantly, there's no substantive, and I mean substantive, reduction of state government. And that's really what's got to happen here in Hartford. When we're talking about uh, an economy uh, in our country and an economy in Connecticut that has been struggling for years, and now we're talking about one of the largest, if not the uh, uh, largest tax increase in the history of our state, uh, that's not the way to address a problem uh, with state government. What should be talked about and what should be part of this budget is a substantive reorganization of state government. This proposal uh, is claiming that there's a 30 percent reduction uh, of state government, but it's only 150 employees. We have 45 to 46,000 state employees. If you're talking about a reduction of 150 state employees, where's that 30 percent come from? So the point is uh, there's much to be uh, 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 wanted from this state budget that's not there. The taxpayers of Connecticut are asking government to live within its means. If the revenue has gone down, let us get to work on matching state government to the revenue that's coming in. Thank you for listening and please stay tuned for further analysis of the state budget proceedings here at the state capitol. Thank you.